Hello guys, how are you doing? This is Tech Rita here with another video. We will fix error 0xec407b application. Was unable to start correctly, let's get started. Press Windows plus R to launch the run command, enter optional features in the text field, and hit enter. Now tick the checkbox for Net Framework 3.5 and click on OK at the bottom to enable the feature. Wait for Windows to install the necessary files and once done, verify the state of the error. Press Windows plus R to launch the Run menu. Enter AppWizBus EPL in the text field and then hit Enter or click OK. Now locate the Microsoft C++ redistributable entry. Select it and click Uninstall. Click Yes in the confirmation prompt that pops up. Next, click Yes in the UAC user account control prompt that appears. Similarly, uninstall the other Microsoft C++ redistributable entries here. Once done, go to the official Microsoft website and download all the Microsoft C++ redistributables you uninstalled earlier. After downloading these, double-click on the file to launch the installer and follow the on-screen instructions to complete the installation process. The C++ redistributable installs the critical files required by applications to function, and if these are outdated or corrupt, you are likely to encounter a 0xe00007b error in Windows 11. Press Windows plus I to launch settings, and select the Apps tab from the navigation pane on the left. Click on Apps and Features on the right. Locate the problematic app, click on the ellipsis next to it, and select Uninstall from the menu. Again, click Uninstall in the confirmation prompt. Restart the computer and then reinstall the app as you did before. Press Windows plus I to launch the Settings app and select Windows Update from the tabs listed in the navigation pane on the left. Now, click on the Check for Updates button on the right. If any available updates are listed after the scan, click on Download and Install to get them on your computer. Navigate to the folder where the problematic application's launcher, Plardexe, is stored. Right-click on it and select Run this program as an administrator. Hello guys, how are you doing? This is Tech Rita here with another video.